Hey guys, it's Lindsay, and welcome back to my channel and to another plan with me. Uh, so for this week, I'm planning out the week of October 5th through the 11th, and I'm finally using a Simply a Mess kit. It is the witchy kit from them. I just loved the colors in this kit, honestly, and it's like more of like a girly type Halloween kit, um, which I'm really excited about, but I know a lot of you guys are probably in the Christmas spirit already or the holiday spirit but um I still have like five Halloween spreads actually I don't think I have that many I have like four and I know for sure I have at least one more fall spread um to do so I'm sorry we got a little bit more Halloween spreads coming for you guys but um hey right now I'm happy I'm even <laughs> uploading a plan with me because I feel like for the most part my plan with me's have just been sporadic which is okay and I know you guys don't really like care as long as you see a plan with me um but as like the person who films these I'm just like I need to get these up sooner so um I don't really know exactly what to talk about I know I just came back from a Washington trip but I do want to actually physically talk about that in that plan with me I'm probably going to do a whole talk through plan with me for that one um so that's will just be a whole entire another story on its own. Um, but for anyone who is curious, I did recently go to Washington. I actually got back um, yesterday. Nope, Sunday. Um, it is Tuesday as I'm recording this voiceover. I'm hoping to get this video up also on Tuesday. Um, so I did get back on Sunday and it was a good trip. It was a long lots and lots of driving um and we literally went up there purely just so we can get my sister her puppy um we now have a new puppy in our family she is a Siberian Husky and Alaskan Malamute mix she is extremely cute just really really loud um and in my haul I filmed a haul yesterday and I posted the story on Instagram which that haul won't be going up for a little while but everyone's like when is that video going up and I'm like I really hope this haul is okay because the amount of just noises in the background from having to deal with her and the amount of jump cuts that I have to do from dealing with her um it's a lot but it's fine we have a new puppy and my sister does work from home so she was working so um we do have to kind of help out a little bit um to make it a little bit easier for her because it is a little stressful having a new brand new puppy and also working from home so yeah that was the whole entire purpose of our trip um my sister didn't want to ship her down from Washington we actually um she knew some people up there and that was how we ended up with her um actually we knew a friend and then the friend I think it was her family I think that's what happened but my sister didn't want to ship her so that is why we drove 20 hours both ways. Actually, it was more than that with stops and everything. It was long driving and um, driving through the night. It was very tiring. But again, I will talk about that more in that other plan with me. Um, I did use silver foil accents for this kit. I kind of thought it worked the best, especially because the um, that full box that I just put that overlay on, um, that like, shirt itself looks like it's like silver glitter um so that's why I did that I also struggled so hard with trying to figure out which full boxes I wanted to use and also struggled a little bit with the deco because there is not very much deco um in this kit but it's fine I made it work we are good so yeah I think that is everything for the base that I really have to say um I think it's just nice honestly to be back to filming plan with me's like I said, I feel like I haven't filmed very many Play With Me's recently, and that's because I am behind, because I got a month behind already, which is so sad, because I finally caught up on Play With Me's, and you know, it's fine. We're good. It's fine. I'm busy. We all get busy, and that's life, you know? That's really all I have to say. Okay, we're going to move on to day by day now. Um, so on Monday, first things first, was the day I finally got my MacBook back. I finally got my computer and it was finally fixed. Um, if you are new to my channel, I had a whole entire computer, broken computer saga um, where I literally, the whole entire screen on my computer would completely go black if I fully opened it. Um, and that broke in April and because of the fact of the pandemic, um, Mac stores have been closed. So they finally opened again. And I was finally able to get my computer fixed, which is nice because I can actually physically look at my computer screen and I, I'm so happy. So I used a paper and milk Moro to mark that, um, just to mark that my computer got fixed. And then I did 
also have a plan with me binge so I used a trigger treat planner that is from pumpkin paper co I believe and this plan with me binge sticker is actually from my shop I can actually say that now it is from my shop I actually use a sticker from my own shop so um yeah that's where that plan with me binge sticker is from and then I did kind of do a little bit weird with the sizing on here. Um, I really hated the way I wrote down twitches, which you guys will see in a second. So I And I actually still hate the way I wrote it down the second time, um, but I wasn't going to redo it again. So I actually hated the way I wrote it the first time. I also ended up smearing it. So I then just put down a um, like squared off fancy label. And then I had to do a little bit of finagling because the label was a little bit bigger than um, the space that was like available. So I then had to fix it and do a little bit of finagling to get it to fix or to be fixed. And then I wrote it again and I still hate the way I wrote it, but it's fine. Um, but I did put down a filming slate that is from Magic Prince Co. And then a um, film script from Kinsey's Creations. And then um, I put down a little witch girl to mark twitches. She is from Pumpkin Paper co i figured she would mark the best just because she's a witch and like in twitches they're witches obviously so i figured it worked it matched and this is me now trying to finagle it because i hated the way i wrote it because it was smeared and i just i absolutely hated it i yeah yep yep <laughs> so here i am just trying to fix it putting the fixing the filming slate and putting it over there which honestly kind of bothers me but it's fine we're leaving it we are leaving it the way it is so yeah, I don't really know what else to talk about since we are literally still at the top of this. I guess I'll talk about the bottom of Monday. Um, so I did play some more Animal Crossing. I think this was the last time I played Animal Crossing was this week. I haven't played it since. Um, so I just used a Wonton in a Million um, sticker that has CJ as the hat on it. And then the Animal Crossing script is from Kinsey's Creations. And then I did use... Um, I stick with a plan code girl with a um, pen to mark that I did create some scripts, which essentially, this is like my version of designing, I guess you can say. It's me writing like all the scripts on my iPad. Um, and I just, I created these create scripts um, stickers a while ago, so I wanted to use them up. And then I did watch One Tree Hill, so I just used a munchkin, nope, that's an emoji, um, to mark that. And then the One Tree Hill script I did make myself. Moving on to Tuesday, I put down a fancy label and a munchkin and then a sleep in script that is from, I think, Station Stickers to mark sleeping in. And then I used a, another pumpkin paper co girl. This one is one with some coffee to mark a Starbucks run. Um, with the fall and the holiday season, I'm going to try to use as many of the like character girl stickers that I have instead of my Simply Watercolor Co. coffee cups just so that I can try to use the character stickers because I want to use all the fall character stickers that I can. So, um, Underneath that, I put down a baby from Once More With Love and a Babysit Ruby sticker who, if you guys don't know, she is my one-year-old niece or she's a little bit older than one now. Um, but she's my niece and I do babysit her majority of the um, time. So, or majority of the week. Or, oh my gosh, why can't I speak? I usually babysit her almost every Tuesday. Mostly. I haven't babysat her for the past like three weeks though. Um, so... Yeah, but I did babysitter, so I, that script I created myself. And then I used a sick with a plan co girl with some stickers to mark that I did just make stickers on this day. This was before I was trying to prep for anything for my shop. This was when I was just making them all for myself. Um, underneath that, I did play The Sims because I was finally able to play The Sims again because my computer was fixed. And gee, what a surprise. That's the first thing I did. Um, so I used a emoji from the Coffee Monsters Co. to mark that and a Play Sim script that is from Kinsey's Creations. And then I put down a squared off quarter box and a fox and cactus girl with a mask because L.A. Zaya, who's actually um, one of my really, really good friends, and she's the one I usually carpool with when I go to work. Um, ooh, that was a weird breathe in. Sorry. <laughs> um, she actually tested positive on this day. I was nowhere near her. I haven't seen her since July for my birthday. Um, but I wanted to mark it just because, I mean, she is probably my closest friend, and she did test positive, and... She is okay now. She did have a lot of lingering, like, symptoms, but she is definitely okay now, which is always a good thing, but I just wanted to mark that she did test positive. And then the movie for this day, um, I did watch Home on the Range, so I used a emoji to mark that, and then the Home on the Range script is one that I just created myself. 
Moving on to Wednesday, I put down a squared off half box and a munchkin just playing in the leaves to mark fall weather because it finally cooled down, which I say this now and it was 90 degrees yesterday, so go Southern California. We love that. Um, but yeah, it was just fall weather and I like marking fall weather, so that's also why in the sidebar I marked that it feels like fall because I was finally able to break out my sweaters and all that stuff and they gave us like fall weather for like three days and it's like here you go here's the summer weather again which sucks but it's fine. Um, and then I did have to babysit again on this day so I used another baby munchkin and another babysit ruby script and then I recorded a voiceover for a plan with me so I used a wonton and a million uh, suey to mark that. Um, I then uploaded a plan with me or a video, I'm assuming it was a plan with me, um, so I used a munchkin just uploading and an upload script that is from Scrub Prince Co. And then I used this planner that is from um, Pumpkin Paper Co. and a plan with me binge, again, that is from my shop to mark a plan with me binge. And then I actually was creating Halloween Town stickers, but um, I actually just never did. So I was like, I'll just write it in. It's fine. Um, so I just used another one of those witches from Pumpkin Paper Co. to mark Halloween Town. And I kind of got into like the Halloween section. So those kind of count as my movies, my Disney movies of the, the day because they are technically Disney movies. And then I did play some more Animal Crossing again. So I just put down a paper and milk um, switch and an Animal Crossing script from Kinsey's Creations. Moving on to Thursday, I did publish a plan with me, so I did take a Mandy Dreams filming slate to mark that, and this was the day I started my character organization video, and just in general my character organization. Um, I'm still working on it, and I when I first posted that photo of me starting the character organization, everyone's like, please tell me you're filming this, please tell me you're filming this. I am, I promise, I'm filming the character organization video, it's just gonna take a while. I am about three quarters of the way done with it. I do still have a little bit more that I need to do, but I am about three quarters of the way done with it, and then it will be up hopefully sometime soon. Um, I will, I do plan on working on it in a, like within the next week or so so hopefully it'll be up soon but yeah I started it on this day and it's for sure taking me at least over a month to do it which I figured it would um but I used a munchkin to mark starting my character organization and then I did film a little bit so I used another Magic Prince Co. filming slate and another film script from Kenzie's Creations and then the movie of this day was The Incredibles so I used a squared off box and an emoji watching some Disney Plus, and then the incredible script is from Scroll Prince Co. Moving down to the bottom of Thursday, um, I put down a odd loop, a girl that is vacuuming to a mark that I did clean my bedroom. I actually have wooden floors in my bedroom and I don't vacuum at all, but I do have these vacuuming stickers and I wanted to use them. And I only ever use these specific vacuuming stickers when I have kits like this where I can because they are a little bit of a darker sticker so I wanted to use it so that is from Odd Loop um, and then I took a Paper Bits Co. Little Bear and a FaceTime script from Kinsey's Creations and then I just wrote in Eva because I did FaceTime one of my friends on this day and then I marked that we had a strawberry smoothie or that I had a strawberry smoothie no idea where it was from but I had a strawberry smoothie, so I um, put down a munchkin with a little pink smoothie to mark that. Moving on to a Friday, I put down a squared off label, and then I was just really tired, I guess, on this day. So I used a insomnia munchkin and then a so tired, which is a custom script that is from Glam Planner, which she recently reopened her custom slots. I don't know if they're still available, but... I actually really like them because you get a ton of scripts. They're a little expensive, but you do get a ton of scripts. Um, and then underneath that, I put down a munchkin with some coffee because my sister did buy coffee um, on this day, so I just wanted to mark that. And then the movie of this day was Pooh's half a lump movie, which I know is technically... I put down Rue for Pooh's half a lump movie, movie but, you know, I didn't want to use Pooh because he didn't match, so... Rue it was. <laughs> he works. Um, and yeah, that was the movie for this day. Um, underneath that, I put down a wonton and a million a steamy with a burrito to mark that I did get El Pollo Loco. And then I apparently bought all the things. I don't know exactly what I bought on this day, but 
I literally just wrote down buy all of the things. So I used an odd loop girl again um, with some shopping bags to mark that. And then I used a Simply a Mess girl, um, like laundry girl and a laundry day custom script because this is technically custom because it has the day in it um, from Kinsey's Creations. And then we did get cold stone on this day, which we don't get cold stone very often, but I don't know, we wanted it. So I used an emoji with a little Sunday to mark cold stone. For once, I feel like I'm actually like ahead of planning, which is weird. I'm always behind, like very rarely I'm actually ahead, but yeah, we're going to keep moving on. Uh, moving on to Saturday, I put down a munchkin with a coffee cup and then a Duncan script from Kinsey's Creations. And we pulled up the floor again. Is anyone surprised? No. Oh, I also put down the weekend banner. Um, no one is surprised. I swear we've just, we're almost done. We're so close to pulling up, finishing pulling up this floor. Um, but I put down a squared off half box and a stick with a plan co girl. To mark pulling up the floor, there's construction outside my house, and they have been doing, like, work since 7 a.m., and I'm just over it, and they're loud. They need to stop. <laughs> ah, they're annoying. Um, anyway, and then underneath that, I put down some little chicken nuggets that are technically from Fox and Cactus. I think they're technically, like, uh, McDonald's chicken nuggets, but I like using them to mark a wing stop because we did have that for lunch. And then I usually don't mark Happy Meal, but I had to have gotten a lot of Happy Meal on this day because I marked so much Happy Meal. And I usually don't mark Happy, happy Meal. So here we are, me marking Happy Meal, and I used one of these little Hedwig um, stickers with a mailbox and yeah, we had Happy Meal. <laughs> and then I used a munchkin to mark editing. And then that edit script is from Kinsey's Creations again. And then I used a squared off box, which I probably should have used a little bit of a bigger one, but that's okay because this Chicken Little script is a little bit bigger. Um, but it doesn't bother, bother me that much. But I did use a squared off label and a emoji that is watching Disney Plus. And then the Chicken Little script I did create myself for the movie of the day. And then I used a stick with a plan co girl with those stickers again to mark that I did pull um, stickers out for my spreads. Which I kind of had to do because I had started that character organization and I just had to pull out stickers for spreads. Otherwise, there was no way I was going to be able um, to film plan with me's because of the amount of like sticker sheets that was everywhere. It was just, it was a mess. So. I had to pull stickers for like four spreads <laughs> on this day. Uh, moving on to Sunday, I put down a snooze munchkin and a label and then a sleep in script that is from Kinsey's Creations because um, I did sleep in on this day. And then we got Duncan again, so I just used a pumpkin spice emoji to mark that. And again, that Duncan script is from Kinsey's Creations. <laughs> so many skip scripts from Kinsey's Creations. Um, next underneath that, I did watch a little bit of football with my dad. Um, so I used a munchkin to mark that. I usually don't watch football very often, but for some reason, I was just like in the living room with him and we were just watching it. I don't know. I guess I just wanted to watch it with him, so... Um, and then we did continue pulling up the floor. No one is surprised. So I used this fan sticky girl um, with a house to mark that. And then I was so tired on this day, just probably from pulling up the floor. So I did. I slept in and I also took a nap. Look at me go with all the sleep. Um, so I put down an emoji to mark um, taking a nap. And then um, this actually, I wrote this in my planner because I was actually planning on this plan with me being up a lot earlier than it is now. But I wrote in my planner, um, or like when I pre-planned this, work on secret pro project, but you guys know that it's an Etsy shop, so I didn't have to write in secret project. Um, but this was the day that I did start working on my Etsy shop and kind of really actually fully deciding to do things and like figuring things out with it and, um... It was really nice. It was really cool. It was actually pretty easy to set up, which I'm genuinely surprised, and my opening day was very smooth, so that is really, really good. So I used a squared off half box and an emoji on a laptop to mark working on the Etsy shop, and last but not least, I watched Halloween Town 2 Calabar's Revenge, so I used a stick with a plan co, um, which to mark that. And that is actually going to be everything for this plan with me. I'm going to let filming Lindsay catch up as she fills in Calabar's revenge and everything. And 
But I think that is everything for this plan with me. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, as always, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe. I like how I'm already doing this, but I'm nowhere near what I'm normally doing this at. Lindsay, slow your roll. There we go. Okay. We're zooming out. Also, I think my camera cut me off at some point, so I think this, like, weirdly jump cuts. But we're putting everything back into the planner. <laughs> um, and I will do a flip through for you guys. Yeah, see, it kind of cuts me off because my camera died or ran out of memory or something um I think it ran out of memory but we're gonna flip through what's left in the kit I actually used a decent amount of it and then I will give you guys a little bit of a viv wiggle there are a lot of scripts in this this spread so the wiggle was actually pretty good in my opinion I don't know you guys tell me I'm I feel like I'm getting worse and worse at the wiggle I don't know but anyway now I can do my little spiel I hope you guys enjoyed this plan with me if you did as always don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you're not already and also leave me some kind of comment down below and follow all of my instagrams that are down below as well and I will see you guys in another video very very soon bye guys